Question number three. You are working as the house captain at your assigned station. You are performing your station inspection and you see a cartoon pinned on the bulletin board in the bunk room that depicts an Asian driver who has been in a traffic accident. The caption has been erased and replaced with the words, Chong has yet another accident. You believe this is in reference to Chong's recent on-duty accident where he struck a pole in the supermarket parking lot. Please describe how you would deal with this situation. The time starts now. All right, so as a house captain in this situation with the cartoon depicting an Asian driver involved in a, a traffic accident, the first thing I want to say is I will be highly disappointed because I know I've laid out my expectations for everyone that works under my supervision, all my subordinates, including my officers. So at this point, um, I would investigate in accordance with the policy 003, which is sexual harassment and discrimination. First thing I'm gonna do is interview all firefighters, beginning with firefighter Chong. I'm gonna bring him in and I'm going to interview him just to get an idea of how he feels about the situation. I'm also gonna let him know that this is not tolerated regardless if he approves or disapproves of the situation regardless. So at that point, I'll lay it out and just let him know I'm offering EAP and that we are going to get to the bottom of the situation. I will continue to interview all the firefighters involved, um, which in this situation will be everybody at the fire station, unless I have an idea of who it might be. At that point, I'm going to interview everybody, and then when I do find out who it is, when I do get to the bottom of it, I'll let them know that this is a zero tolerance policy, that it will not be tolerated, and that um, obviously they will have to be disciplined in some sort of way. Um, at my point, at my level, I'm allowed to write up the, the person and it's end up to the chain of command to the executive officer of the fire department. So with that, I'm also going to make sure I do follow-up training because we will have to correct the behaviors and practices at our firehouses. We're going to make sure we, we do corrective training for the next three months and we're gonna do follow-up training even after that. So the training won't stop there, but I'm gonna continue to monitor even after I've conducted the training. Um, I'm trying to change the culture. I'm trying to change the behaviors and practices so that there are no further incidents of this, this such. I'm also gonna make sure that there's no other de um, cartoon, discriminatory, um, anything that's offensive to a race, religion, whatever it may be, in the firehouse. So I'll continue to inspect the firehouse and make sure that there's no other uh, material that could be the construed, con misconstrued or in violation of the policy. I'm gonna document this. I'm gonna offer EAP to everybody to make sure that they are aware that, that there is help out for them if they feel like they've been offended. And <clears throat> my job as the house captain is to change the culture and make sure we're professionals and I will do so and and starting with this incident and my expectations will we'll move forward and continue to do what we have to do. It's